watching. But that doesn't mean all you need is a bouquet of roses. No, no, no. We went to an expert to find out how you can find romance with some real flower power. It's the pretty woman holder. What the heck? Oh, no, it's a rose. <laughs> <laughs> yes, I definitely have a Valentine this year. Um, I'm not going to say any names, but yeah. <laughs> As hearts break across Canada, funky model turned actor Nick Bateman is getting a boost in the bouquet department from rich bride, poor bride, Serena Lenke. I like to be classic, so when I see a rose, I usually go for So that. like classic red roses? Yeah. Ah. Okay, Nick, I love you, but roses, seriously, it's like low-hanging fruit. You know, okay. it's the easiest thing. All right, well, maybe Nick isn't really all that adventurous with flowers, but he's definitely got some ideas when it comes to romancing his lady. I used to go to karate school, and it was all magical on the floor and I took little posted notes and I wrote uh, on every single note on every single mat a reason why I loved her when she got to the end it was like she's like sitting in a pile of reasons why I loved her very sweet Nick but if you're hoping to catch that side of him on screen you might think twice about his new movie which premiered at Sundance in Hobo with a Shotgun, it plays the son of a criminal kingpin. Getting to take a role and get really into it and uh, become so, like a character is so challenging and fun. So, today's challenge, flowers. Is there anything else on the table that you like? Orchids. Orchids. Anything that is in glass that is enclosed yeah. is a really hot trend right now. Perhaps you're just at the kind of the dating stage or just getting to know you stage. Tulips. Tulips are definitely an I like you flower. And they're really different. Oh. And one bouquet of this, half the price of a dozen roses. You know, so this... Yeah. <laughs>